Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this September the 25th, 2014 meeting of the Hanover Township Committee has been provided in accordance with the Open Public Meetings Act by posting written notice and agenda of this meeting on the bulletin board in this municipal building at 1000 Route 10, Township of Hanover, and by hand delivering, mailing, faxing such notice and agenda to the following newspapers. Morris County's Daily Record, the Star Ledger, Hanover Eagle, and by filing same with the Township Clerk. May I have a roll call, please? Committee Man Gallagher. Here. Committee Man Faramaska is away on uh, business. Committee Man Bruno. Here. Committee Man Capola. Here. And Mayor Francioli. Here. Four members in attendance. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, can you all please rise and join me in a pledge of allegiance to our flag? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. Please be seated. We have a few wonderful things to do tonight. And uh, the very first one that uh, all of our young ladies are, are going to witness here is the administration of an oath of office to a brand new and additional patrolman to our police force. And uh, at this time, Joseph, where are you? Come ask you. Joseph's going to come forward. All right. faith and allegiance to the same, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, and to the governments established in the United States, and to the governments established in the United States, and in this state, and in this state, under the authority of the people, under the authority of the people, and that I will faithfully, and that I will faithfully, impartially, impartially, and justly perform, and justly perform, all the duties of the office of patrolman, all the duties of the office of patrolman, according to the best of my ability, according to the best of my ability, so help me God, so help me God. Congratulations. Okay. I just want to say That's the last time you want to see this brand new patrolman, right? Okay. I like to just, uh, I just like to comment Joseph, briefly, please. Uh, Richard Comaster, our newest patrolman, uh, grew up in Hanover Township, went to school here. He graduated from Whitney Park High School, a member of the National Honor Society. He also graduated, he did graduate from the County College of Morris on a dean list and then attended Keene University. Richard majored in physical education and adult fitness. He was on the dean's list at Keene College University and graduated cum laude honors. Richard graduated from the Morris County Police Safety Training Academy in June of 2014. He is a certified strength and conditioning specialist <clears throat> as per the National Conditioning Association. And in his spare time, he likes to lift weights and play basketball. I would gather that. <laughs> Richard has held such jobs as labor, truck driver, performance coach, and physical therapist. We all would like to, on behalf of the entire township committee, would like to welcome Richard to the Hanover Township Police Family. Wish you much luck in our new job. Welcome aboard, Richard. Welcome. Very good. <laughs> You're joining a fine, fine group of officers, in my opinion. Very good. Happy to have you aboard. Son of a gun. Recognize past Mayor John Sheridan sitting in the office tonight. John, how you doing? Very good. Good. 
nice to see you. You kept the seat warm. That's good. Oh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> it's a wonderful honor we've got tonight, young ladies. You've done us proud here in Hanover Township, and all of these committee men are all very, very proud of you for your accomplishment. And what we're going to do is we're going to have a resolution read into the record for you. And uh, more importantly than the resolution you read into the record are these things that are in front of me right now. And uh, just shortly, we're going to present those to you, too, as well. And uh, Mr. Robert Bruno, who's our Director of Recreation, is going to have a few words in a second. But right now, I'd like someone to offer the resolution. Motion to offer a resolution. So moved. Second. Moving second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All right. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to read this to you. And uh, it, is, it's as follows. A resolution of the Township Committee congratulating all the members of the Hanover Township Little League, nine, ten-year-old, all-star team, on winning District 1, Section 1 softball championships and becoming the runner-up champs in the State Little League Tournament. That's absolutely fantastic. You did wonderful, ladies. Wonderful. And whereas the Township uh, of Hanover Little League, nine, ten-year-old all-stars team, won the District 1, Section 1 championship and are the runner-ups in the State Little League tournament, and whereas the team has accomplished an impressive record over the course of the season, which, uh, which record deserves the praise and admiration of the citizens of the township, and whereas the township committee recognizes the good sportsmanship, camaraderie, team spirit of the All-Stars and their coaches in working together as a unit in this highly competitive sport, and whereas the governing body is extremely pleased to honor these team members on this memorial occasion, and now therefore be resolved by the Township Committee of the Township of Hanover, County of Morris, State of New Jersey, that the governing body offers sincere congratulations and best wishes to all, by all the residents of our township to the following members. Hanover Township Little League, nine, ten-year-old All-Stars softball team. And I'm going to let Bob join me, and we're going <coughs> to cite the names of all the members of this wonderful team. And we've got a nice little presentation for you, both in a trophy and some shirts. I'll give you my same old comment about the shirts. Don't wash them in hot water. And... Uh, <laughs> Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, let yes. me well, um, interject, if I here? may. Go ahead. Um, again, girls, congratulations. I had the privilege of coaching four of you during the regular season. Um, and in spite of my coaching, you went on to uh, have a very successful all-star team this summer, which is fantastic. You forgot all the, th all the bad habits that I taught you, I'm sure. Um, but for you 12 young ladies, it's just a fantastic accomplishment. Um, in addition, I think we need to congratulate the parents, girls, and maybe you'll help me do that in just a second, because they had a kind of a two-month odyssey of driving not only to practices over here at Veterans Field, which I'm sure you were very appreciative of, uh, but all those trips up to Ringwood, up 287, um, all those trips down to Middletown, and they did it out of love, and I know they um, enjoyed every minute of it, but it, I'm sure there were also some nights where it got to be a little bit old, especially when the weather was threatening, you weren't sure if you were going to play that night, you had to drive up there anyway, um, and it was all for a great cause. But girls, maybe what you could do is just stand up and give your parents a round of applause for all the appreciation for all that they did for you. Thank you, girls. The rest, the rest of the night is about you, I promise. Um, <laughs> But we did want to make just a brief mention of uh, some others that were involved in your success. Um, without delay, I'm now going to call up Mr. John Hockman, who's the manager of the team. He put together a little video, and I think we may have someone to assist him. Silvio, if you don't mind. And maybe while we're doing that, because undoubtedly there'll be some technical difficulties, but guys, if you don't mind, um, maybe we'll just ask some of the girls to tell us what was the most fun part of the whole season. Alyssa? You always have something to say. You're never <laughs> shy. Was, Alyssa, what was the most fun part of this whole tournament? Um, winning. Winning? Winning. Excellent. Winning, winning is good. Well, if winning didn't matter, they wouldn't keep score, <laughs> right? So winning is kind of important. Giovanna? Having fun. Having fun. Fantastic. Maya? Playing. Playing was fun. Good. Any other, I don't want to pick on everybody. Any other volunteers? Rose, what was fun? The last strike. The last strike. Excellent. All right. How are we doing on that video, gentlemen? We'll keep going with the, uh, what was the most fun part? 
Who else is over there? Who did I miss? Where's Katie? Katie, what was the most fun part? The whole experience. The whole experience. Excellent. We're getting to be politically correct as we go. <laughs> Some of you may be future committee persons, committee ladies. Anybody else over on this side? What was the most fun? Jenny? Oh, it's okay, Jenny. You can, uh, you can make some. What was the most fun? Being with your friends. How about the camaraderie girls, right? I think that is a real important part of it because if everybody wasn't getting along, we probably wouldn't have had this level of success. We're still filling time here. Who else has a... Uh, Technology is our friend. How did I know we would have trouble with this? Evelyn? What was the most fun, Evelyn? Hitting the ball. Hitting the ball? Okay. Melina? I think, I think we're getting close. Who did we pick on yet? Megan? Who's Megan? Come on, Megan. What was the most fun? We'll skip over her. Where's Jenny? Jenny, what was the most fun for you? Where, oh, you are Jenny. Julia. Julia, what was the most fun? Sylvia, what'd you do? 
Oh. Enter key. I don't want to have I, I don't want to have it. Get a kid to work on it. I was just going to say the same thing. The kids can probably troubleshoot it. I know. Girls, next year when you're 12 new champs, you'll come back and we'll watch this video and your new video next year. How's that sound? You're ready. Oh. You don't like it here? We'll definitely get to see it tomorrow. All right, you know what? Maybe we'll move yeah. on to the individual awards, girls. We don't want to keep you here all night. There you go. <coughs>
John Swan. with the rest of our meeting, but you know what? What, what do you want to do? Oh, I'm sorry. Coach, go ahead. Coach, go ahead. In a public place, I just wanted to thank you. I won't go long here, but when we went down to the state tournament, um, needless to say, we had never been there before. Um, there was a team back in 2008 who went, but um, this group, a whole new set of parents, a whole new set of girls, uh, other teams brought some goodie bags. We went down there, we had no idea. Well, we came home and we scrambled the next morning, and um, I would really like to thank the town uh, mayor, especially my wife came in, worked with people, worked with uh, people in your office. You were very accommodating, um, very generous, and helped us put together a very nice goodie bag that we could go down and present to the other teams. And they were very excited to receive it, and it looked very good upon handover. So I want to thank the town. For I'm glad we could do it. Also, you know, Brian, a uh, friend in the Department of Public Works and his team do a great job with the field. And Denise and her team at Parks and Recreation do a great job with, with scheduling everything. And through that whole team effort, um, in addition to the support we had from the Little League and the parents, was, was tremendous this past summer and, and very helpful um, and appreciative as we, we uh, were able to do this. And at the, at the state tournament, the, uh. the, they took a picture. Unfortunately, there's a few of our girls who were, were not in it due to injury or, or, or unable to be there. but. Um, it has all the, the Little League trim and, and print on it, and I'm willing to uh, 
give this to the town. So Beautiful. That, uh, We've got just a spot for you. See that back panel there? Yeah. It's going to go right up there. Go so perfect. It's going to go right up there. Excellent. Here. There you go. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. That's good. Thank you for attending. Yeah. So they get big and right there you go. There you go. Now you're on you now it'll be on YouTube. <laughs> right? Okay. There you go. Well you see all the nice comments under that. That's gonna be great. Very good. Uh, we're gonna continue with the rest of the meeting. If you'd like to stay and listen to this, you're more than welcome to. But you want my advice? <laughs> good time. I'll give you ten minutes to make it to that door. <laughs> Okay, just... Very good. I'm sorry, thank you. Okay, uh, all right, gentlemen, we're, we're going to continue now uh, with this portion of the meeting. Um, I'm going to ask for a motion to open to the public. So moved. Is that up here on the agenda? Oh, so okay. moved. Open. Second. Everyone in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, the floor is open. Anyone who would like to address the Township Committee at this time can do so from the podium, giving us your name and address for the record. Seeing none, hearing none. Oh, Jim, you want to say something? No? Move we close. Okay. <laughs> Second. Close. Motion so close. Okay. All in favor? Aye. All right. Mr. Administrator. Okay. As we continue the approval of the Township Committee minutes, the regular minutes of uh, September 11th, <clears throat> and the bid reception committee meeting of September the 9th. May we have a motion so for moved. approval? We have a motion. Second. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. So approved, ladies and gentlemen. We only have one ordinance docketed for introduction this evening. It is ordinance number 40-2014. It's an ordinance of the Township Committee amending and supplementing Chapter 166 of the Code uh, entitled Land Use and Development Legislation by amending the provisions concerning site plan exemption for minor conforming developments. Uh, this ordinance will be further considered for public hearing and final passage at a meeting of the Township Committee on the 23rd of October at 8.30 p.m. here in the main meeting room. And at that time, any person wishing to be heard concerning the ordinance will be given the opportunity to be heard. The ordinance and the notice of introduction will be published in full in the Morris County Daily Record in accordance with law. And we'll also note for the record that in accordance with the Municipal Land Use Law, the ordinance will be referred to the planning board for referral and recommendation. So at this time, may we have a motion to introduce ordinance no. number 40. Second. Yeah. We have a motion by Mr. Pola, seconded by Mr. Gallagher. On roll call, Mr. Gallagher. Aye. Mr. Bruno. Aye. Mr. Coppola. Aye. And Mr. Francioli. Aye. So approved. And this Thank ordinance for, uh, for the folks uh, on the uh, minor conforming uh, development for planning. This, this streamlines the process a little bit more and puts it before a spec committee. Uh, it's a benefit to the applicant, it's a benefit to the township. Uh, the uh, applicant in this case does not require uh, the, both the, the fees and the legal representation that would come with a full application uh, on a minor like this. It can be handled by a spec committee much more expeditiously and we're doing that to streamline it for all parties, both the planning board and the applicant. So, 
Thank you. Okay, thank you, Ron. Now moving it, uh, forward, ladies and gentlemen, the next portion of business on pages one and two uh, are the resolutions under consent agenda. We do not have any additional resolutions for consideration. Are there any questions from members of the governing body concerning any of the resolutions listed on pages one and two? Oh, good. Second. We have a motion by Mr. Capola, seconded by Mr. Bruno on roll call. Mr. Gallagher. Aye. Mr. Bruno. Aye. Mr. Capola. Aye. And Mr. Francioli. Aye. So approved. And as we continue, we have now raffle applications at the bottom of page two and the top of page three. Are there any questions concerning any of the raffle applications? Seeing none, hearing none, may we have a motion on the approval? We have a motion Second. by Mr. Capola, seconded by Mr. Bruno. On roll call for approval, Mr. Gallagher. Aye. Mr. Bruno. Aye. Mr. Capola. Aye. And Mr. Francioli. Aye. Mr. Chairman, members of the Township Committee, that clears the agenda of the Business Administrator, Township Clerk, and I thank you. Oh, thank you, Joe. Okay. Very good. Uh, gentlemen, is there any other business from the Township Committee at this time? I'd just like to say one thing. Tom, go ahead. I'd just like to thank Hanover Township's own America Martial, American Martial Arts here in Pine Plaza and Planet Swirl. We had Hanover Youth Nights last Friday night. It was a big success. A lot of children had a good time. And uh, we're going to be doing it again. So thank you very much to Hanover Township's AMA and Planet Swirl. There you go. There you go. A uh, couple little reminders. I'll let Bob, do you have any comments? No. George? Yeah, just that okay. uh, on its one day, one, one day, one school which we'll be doing shortly, I'm really happy to say that we're going to be doing a very joint effort of doing all the cooking by both the Knights of Columbus from East Hanover and Whippany. So it'll be good to see both groups together. Good. Very good. That's it. A uh, little reminder, uh, this Monday, uh, if you haven't had your flu shot, this will be the first of three opportunities you have here at the township. Uh, this Monday from 10 to, 10 to 12, 10 to 1? 10 to 12. I think 10 to 1. 10 to 1. I think it's 10, 10 to 1. Be there before 12. Uh, and uh, the township for uh, uh, those of us who are seniors, the flu shot is absolutely free. For those of us who are not, I think there's a very nominal fee for the flu shot. Uh, but I, I highly suggest that if you haven't had it, you take advantage of it. There'll be some other dates. There's two other dates that will be posted one as well. One is evening. Yeah. From 4 to 6. There'll be one yeah. afternoon and yes. then one evening date as well. That are, that are coming up. It's $15 for those who don't qualify. Is it 15 yeah. for 15 for yeah, those who are not website, seniors? So I'm yeah. sure you can okay. look it up on the website. Or you, or you website. could lie and say you're 65, that's all. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the, um, I, I want to, uh, on the behalf of the Township Committee, uh, to all of our Jewish friends, Hebrew friends, to wish them a very, very happy New Year on this Rosh Hashanah, a very, very special time, and we wish the best to you and your families uh, on this occasion. Uh, is there anything else from the committee? Hearing none, I'm going to uh, motion to open the floor once again. So Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. The floor is open. Anyone who would like to address the township committee can do so from the podium at this time, giving us your name and address for the record. No? Okay. Motion uh, so moved. Closed. Seeing none, motion closed. So moved and seconded. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Motion to close. Second. Okay. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are adjourned. Okay, I'm going to take these inside. Another time. Oh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, 7-Eleven? Yeah, the 7-Eleven. Quick check me. Quick check me. Uh, I saw the article.